is Laura from Laura's Adventures in Buckland, and this is my showcase Sunday for um, November 11th, 2011. And then this is going to cover two weeks. Um, last week, we were so busy. It was my son's birthday party. My computer crapped out on me, so I didn't even post this showcase Sunday on my blog. It was ugh, awful, awful, awful. Um, so, yeah, I got eight bucks. Uh, they're all from Half Price Books, which, as you know, is my favorite store ever. Um, I guess we'll start out with this. I got two swag things. I got a bookmark that says, Believe, if you believe, you can do it, you can. Um, and it's made out of, like, little pictures. And then I also got another one that says, Imagine. And I don't remember what the little quote on it is, but I like the ones with the little tassel thingies on it. And then I also, uh, they gave a calendar out, which if you spent, uh, like $30, you got a calendar or something like that. Uh, and they had coupons this week, too. Uh, they do, like, 40% off for Monday and Tuesday, and then Wednesday and Thursday is 30%, and then Friday and Saturday is 20 and then today, oh, there's a 50% off one today, but I'm not going because my husband doesn't want me to. Whatever. <laughs> uh, but they did give these 50% uh, off. Uh, throughout the whole year, they're... It looks to me... Yeah, there's one... I mean, a 50% off one for once a month, so that's pretty cool. I will definitely be doing that. So, okay, let's do last week's. Uh, this is Burn for Burn by Jenny Han and Siobhan Vivian. I don't know how to pronounce that name. I butchered that. I apologize. Uh, but this is one of those wraparound covers that I really like. I don't really know what this is about. I just remember that I requested this on NetGalley, and they either were offering it in, in the U.S., or they were giving limited copies or something. Either way, I didn't get it. So when I found this at Half Price Books, I was like ec ecstatic. Um, I have a thing for light colored books too. And the actual cover of this book is white. So that's kind of neat. It is in perfect condition. I love finding good condition books. Uh, I also got The Future of Us by Jay Asher and Carolyn Mackler. Uh, this is about uh, two kids that find their Facebook pages uh, from, their, they live in 1996, and they find their Facebook pages, which obviously aren't invented yet, um, and that's all I know about that. So there's that. I read 13 Reasons Why by Jay Asher, and I really loved it, uh, so I hope I like that one as much. Um, this one was kind of an accident. I didn't have my phone with me. I left it in the car, so I couldn't look it up, and I was in a hurry. I wasn't going to go back outside, uh, but it's because it is My Blood by Gabrielle uh, Zevin, which I love the cover of. Uh, this is the second book in the series, which I kind of thought it was, but I couldn't remember, and it is, so I just picked it up anyway. Uh, it's, it's in really good condition. And like I said, I had that coupon, so... Or no, this one didn't have coupons. That's this week's. But, oh well. I'll just have to find the first one. And then I also got uh, Blessed by Tanya Hurley. Super creepy cover. But it's really pretty, but it's super creepy. And then if you take the desk jacket off, the actual cover of, like, the spine of the book is really pretty, but there is another cover on the back, which is also super creepy. So, at least it's got that going for it. I have no idea what that's about either. I just heard that it was, that it was good. I also got this week, these are this week's books, I got Incantation by Alice Hoffman. I have no idea what it's about. I just like the cover. And uh, it was a dollar. It was on clearance. 
So, I went ahead and picked it up. I have picked this book up quite a few times off of the clearance shelf and put it back. So, this week I was like, ah, I'm not buying a lot of books. I'll just grab it. It was one of the last things I grabbed. <laughs> I also got Catalyst by Lori Hulse Anderson. I was kind of excited to find this book. Uh, I read uh, Speak by her, and I really enjoyed it. So, uh, I hope this is good. I believe it's about a girl who is waiting on um, her letter from college to say whether she got in or not. And I don't think she got in. And for some reason, it's a big deal to everybody in her school. And they have a bet going on that she didn't get in or something. I'm not sure. Uh, this is Adaptation by Melinda Lowe. This is another one of those books that I've seen in there for the past few weeks, and I would pick it up and put it back because I hadn't heard anything about it. But this week I just, I gave up and I bought it. It just, it looks too good. It's, it's one of those ones where I think the girl wakes up after an accident and she can't remember and she's got to figure out why, why she can't remember what happened. So, that sounds interesting. I kind of like the cover, too. It's kind of neat. And then, last one, Paper Towns by John Green. Uh, this is actually on the cart for them to put, for the books that need to be put on the shelf. Uh, so, naturally, I just grabbed it off the, the cart. It's actually going to bug me a little bit because, where are they? Oh, here they are. Um, all the books I have by him are in paperback, and this one's hardback, and I kind of have a weird thing. It's not going to bug me as much because it's not a part of a series, and, you know, they're different, but it's still, I don't know, it kind of looks a little funny. But that is all I got this week. I don't think I got anything off NetGalley, at least not that I can remember. And I don't think I got anything off of, for my Kindle. So, yeah, that's it. Um, links will be below. Again, uh, like and subscribe to this video if you want to see more videos from me. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.